Good morning, Ainsley. Steve, great to be with you Good and happy new, year. Happy, happy new year. Happy New Year. So what is on tap for 2018? Well, there's a lot that we're going to be doing in 2018, and, and it starts where we left off. Tax reform is working incredibly well. We're seeing our economy take off. The next big thing you're going to see is, is a need for workers. And I think the best thing we can do is to go and reform those welfare programs that are trapping people in a failed welfare state. Let's actually put some work requirements in place so that we can get people back to work, mm -hmm. rebuild the middle class. Uh, then we're going to have to work on health care again. Look, I'm, I'm for repealing and replacing Obamacare. One of the best things we did is repeal the individual mandate because that really undoes a lot of the stools of Obamacare. Uh, now we need to go and fix the things that are broken in health care that are jacking up costs. And so let's get back to work on some of those things like what we passed in the House that almost passed in the Senate uh, so that we can get get our health care system working again, rebuild a private marketplace, and then let's work to get back to a balanced federal budget. Uh, it's something we can absolutely do with the growth we're getting mm -hmm. out of the tax cuts. Well, the budget isn't even close to being balanced right now. And in fact, you got to figure a way to fund the government. The deadline's going to be, Steve, on January 19th. How far are the two sides apart? Because I know there are members of your own party in the Freedom Caucus. They feel like the Republicans are, are going to be spending way too much money. Well, you know, we're not that far apart if you look at the negotiations that had been going on before tax reform. Uh, when, when we moved to cut taxes, the Democrats just walked away from the table because they didn't want people to get more of their hard-earned money. But look how great it's working. You can go to uh, my, my website, majoritywhip.gov slash tax reform works and see a list of dozens and dozens of companies that are giving bonuses to workers, raising their pay of their workers. Uh, but the next thing we've got to do is properly fund defense. And, and whether you're in the Freedom Caucus or RSC or the Tuesday group within our conference, I think we all acknowledge uh, that we've got to get back to properly uh, funding our defense in a way that we can meet all of these growing threats, mm -hmm. working with President Trump, who has a great commander in chief, as you talked about earlier, supporting the unrest in Iran, the people that are rising up against their corrupt government, uh, moving to uh, move the, uh, the capital, uh, the United States Embassy to Jerusalem. Uh, I think we're going to have to make sure we're continuing to do what we can to give our men and women in uniform the support they need. What about immigration? Because the president has been saying, he's tweeted, tweeted at the um, end of the month in December about, you give us the wall, we give you DACA. What's the latest on that? And do you see that, can there be a compromise? You think that'll happen? I think there is an agreement that can be reached. It's got to start with border security, though, in putting money in place to start building the wall, as, as President Trump said. He campaigned on this, and he won the presidency with this being a front and center issue. Uh, let's go and secure our border just by the talk of President Trump saying that we're going to secure the border and enforce our laws. You're seeing a dramatic drop in illegal border crossings, but there's more that needs to be done. As it relates to DACA, uh, look, we need to end chain migration. Mm -hmm. uh, we need to end this lottery system that, as we've seen time and time again, is a failed and flawed system. Let's get back to the things that work. We let a million people into our country legally every year, the most generous nation in the world. Let's strengthen that legal system and border security in place. And I think you can see an agreement that can be reached. Well, you've got a lot on your plate. Good luck to you. Uh, Steve Scalise joining us today from New Orleans. Sir, thank you very much, and Happy New Year. Thank you so much. Happy New Year. Great to be with y'all. You bet. Did you go to the game last night? Did we lose him? I watched the game, yeah. but boy, New Orleans was uh, was hopping. And look, the Saints are on path right now to win the Super Bowl. we got to take care of Carolina in the Superdome this Sunday. All right. Well, thanks so much. One step at a time. <laughs>